Hi everyone, it's Laura Frontero. I uh, wanted to bring to you tonight a little bit of information about Elite. There are one, two, three, four, five ingredients in our new Elite um, product. And I wanted to take some time to break down each one of those, but tonight we're just gonna talk about one. And um, so what we're gonna talk about is Indian gooseberry. What the heck is that stuff anyway? I have questions because this is not my area of specialty. So I spoke with Carolyn Perini, who is one of our product formulators. And for those of you who don't know who Carolyn Perini is, um, pretty much superstar. She is a formulation consultant for medical and supplement lines. She's a clinical uh, laboratory scientist. She's a member of the American Society of Clinical Pathologists. She is a certified nutritional consultant, a medical microbiologist specializing in hematology and immunology. And I hold this woman in the highest regard and esteem. Um, she is an absolute expert in her field and she <laughs> won't put anything in her own body that she hasn't actually clinically tested in her own laboratory. She tests things for purity. She's the one who took a bottle of skin serity and tested it to see if it was as pure and as great as our founders had suggested that it was. So I had a long talk with Carolyn and she kind of broke down the Indian gooseberry and ashwagandha for me. So the, the first important thing um, that she told me and and this is key and critical and very meaningful that um, That the ashwagandha and Indian gooseberry blend that we have in elite is trademarked. It's a proprietary standardized formulation and Its effectiveness is supported. Are you ready? Because this is what really excites me its effectiveness is supported by randomized, controlled, double-blind um, human clinical trials. That's a big deal. You know, I don't know why I'd expect any less. We had skincerity that came from years and years of NIH grant-funded research. We have Renew that came from a Nobel Prize winning technology. I'm not surprised that one of the key ingredient blends in Elite has this kind of uh, clout and study behind it and that it's been proven safe for human consumption. And this is um, really a big deal to me. The um, ashwagandha Indian gooseberry is uh, manufactured here in the United States. And like I said, it's a standardized formulation, which is important. You're gonna be getting what is labeled in the bottle because of that standardized formulation. This isn't something that's just, you know, being chip, shipped in from overseas and randomly put into our product. It's actually uh, being manufactured here in the United States. So let's talk a little bit about Indian gooseberry tonight because um, each one of the ingredients in this product has importance and each one is a big topic. So I thought we'd break it down into smaller parts. So for Indian gooseberry, I want you to think about anti-aging from the inside out. Uh, the majority of our skin products are something that we put topically on our face uh, or anywhere on our body and we get an anti-aging effect from the outside. This product it actually works from the inside out and it does this um, for a couple of reasons and again we're just going to focus on Indian gooseberry tonight but the big thing is preserving collagen, uh, elastic preserving collagen, preserving elasticity and tone and reducing um, wrinkles and dryness. So you can think of it as a beauty food. And, it, and again, this is a food. Indian gooseberry is derived from a berry from India. It's something that is eaten there. Um, oftentimes it's pickled, oftentimes it's um, served with chili even, and it's um, you know a, a normal part of the Indian diet. And what is impressive about Indian gooseberry is it's antioxidant effect and oh boy this is really exciting so the way that I understand it the way Carolyn explained it to me when you ingest antioxidants you're eating you know raspberries or blueberries or when you're ingesting vitamin C you're kind of destroying free radicals um, on a one-on-one -on -one basis but what Indian gooseberry does is it actually sends signals to our genes to make our own antioxidants this is better than ingesting something from food because when you make your own brand of antioxidants, they're going to be much more efficient and effective at reducing oxidative stress on the body. And this is one of the main causes of aging is this oxidation process. Free radicals are um, 
created during oxidation and free radicals are damaging to our skin. It's one of the main reasons that we get wrinkles, that, we, that our cells age even anywhere in the body. So when you are making your own antioxidants, you are destroying millions of free radicals at a time instead of just one by one by one when you're ingesting um, an antioxidant like a blueberry, for example. So that was very exciting to me when, um, when I learned that from Carolyn. And I just wanna talk a little bit more about free radicals um, just so you understand the reason that we have free radicals in the body um, and, and what causes them. So what happens, um, free radicals are formed for a couple of reasons. We have intrinsic and extrinsic factors. So intrinsic means something in the body is causing the free radical to form. So the thing is, it's a byproduct of cellular metabolism and we can't stop cellular metabolism. This is happening all day long, every day, constantly. So free radicals are constantly generated. And then an extrinsic factor would be something like UV light, and chemical pollutants. So clearly you can't control free radical production in the body because you can't control um, cellular metabolism and you can't really control uh, UV light and chemical pollutants unless you pretty much never go outside and live in a bubble. Um, so it's important to have something to fight these free radicals. And that's where um, ingredients like Indian gooseberry come in because again, it stimulates your body to produce its own um, destruction of free radicals, which is it just blew my mind when I learned this. This is a, a whole new area for me to learn. And in typical, you know, Laura fashion, I need to learn everything I can about it. I need to ensure that the um, ingredients in this are sourced from a safe place and that what I'm putting in my body is also safe. And I know that's important to you as well. So I just wanted to give you a quickie on Indian gooseberry. We're going to keep talking about other ingredients and um, keep going with this. And I'll keep posting videos as we talk about each of the ingredients. But um, that's about it for Indian gooseberry tonight. I want you to think of this as a beauty food. I want you to think of this as preserving collagen, elasticity, and tone. And I want you to think of it as um, an ingredient that sends signals to the genes to make our own antioxidants. And our own brand of antioxidant is much more efficient and effective than ingesting antioxidants from food sources. So that's it for tonight. Thank you so much. And you all have a great evening and I'll talk to you really soon. Bye now.